in my estimation, they are qualitatively different. What Hamas is, what is Can I pu answer? publicly what they're doing okay. is genocide. What Israel's doing is not genocide. There's a difference between what Israel, you could say both Israel and Hamas have engaged in genocidal and murderous rhetoric. No. And I'll give you an example. No, yes, no, they have. No, you can't. Benjamin Netanyahu, no, you, I is can't. Is it uncensored or not? Yes, let me OK, you can say let me, quote, let me quote what the, the Israeli authorities have said. Go on. Benjamin Netanyahu, when he quoted Amalek, mm. the scriptures, what does Amalek say? Mm. זכור את אשר עשה לך מה עמלק נצטווינו. אנו זוכרים ואנו נלחמים. He quotes Amalek when they attacked the Israelites. And what God told the Israelites to do was to destroy every kill, every man, woman, child and livestock. If I would put it to you, an Islamist leader was quoting a similarly genocidal passage from the Quran you would not, I would say, respond? hesitate. Can I respond? Well, what, no, no, what, what? we haven't... Just, no, but you've had we'll a lot. Respond to that I'm going to respond just quickly. Israeli officials said mm. that Gaza will end up being a city of tents with no building standing, mm. that, they are, that they are attacking for damage, not for accuracy. The agricultural minister, Avi Dikti, he said we are rolling out a new Nakba. A Nakba is the mm. mass expulsion, 700,000 mm. Palestinians in 1948. Mm. This is why hundreds of genocide scholars, people who are actually, unlike you or I, mm. experts in the field of genocide mm. studies, fear okay. that a genocide is taking place. So the difference between Israel Let and Hamas now. is Hamas does not have the capacity to wipe out no. Israel. Israel is wiping that's Gaza the point. off the map. Israel could, if they wanted to, kill everyone in Gaza. They decided not to do so that. Is your definition, so they're not, to be genocide very, is where you want to kill everyone. Sorry, sorry. Your definition of genocide, because in Ukraine, Vladimir Putin hasn't killed every last Ukrainian. Oh, that simply not happened. No, 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 he hasn't. And, and nor has he stated no. his intention to do so. And nor, as brutal and uh, barbaric... Actually, actually sorry, to be, to be Vladimir Putin, to be absolutely, no, by illegally no, invading a sovereign he hasn't, country and, and, no, and no, no, indiscriminately no, bombing yeah. anything in front of him... Indiscriminately bombing? ...is ah, waging I'm a sorry. form of genocide. Wow. Indiscriminate bombing, mm. Gaza, more than two Hiroshima bombs worth have been dropped on mm. East London in the space of five okay, weeks. OK, let me ask you two questions. No 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 no, 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 no. You said Ukraine. No, I'm going to have to put this to you. OK. 15,000 people have mm. now been killed mm. now by the Israelis, mm. estimate, in Gaza. One in every 200 people in Gaza have now been killed. Mm. If you were to adjust for population in Ukraine, mm. that would be 300,000 Ukrainian civilians. Mm. 300,000, there's been a terrible death toll. It's estimated by the UN, 10,000 civilians have been killed mm. since February last year. Mm. In the space of five weeks, mm. a country with a much, much smaller population has had a much higher death, has had a death toll mm. higher officially than that, that in okay. Ukraine. So how, can it, how can it be... I'm going to answer. How can it be that you call that genocide, yep. but when you have nearly half the entire a civilian death toll of the Bosnian war mm. in a country which is twice the size in terms of population. Why isn't that genocide bit?